So trichloroethanoic acid has a pKa value of 0 0.8, which is the pH of a 0 0.05 molar solution. Now you can see that with a pKa value of 0 0.8, it's a fairly strong sort of acid. Uh, remember that pKa is equal to the negative log of your Ka value. So the smaller the pKa value, <coughs> the stronger the acid you're going to have. Now, for us, we need to work out the Ka value for this uh, acid. So we're going to need to take the inverse of that, if you like, and say, OK, then, so um, the Ka is going to be equal to 1 times 10 to the minus P K A which of course is equal to 1 times 10 to the minus 8 which if you do the calculation should come out to be 0 0.158 we can therefore put that into our weak acid expression where we take K A is equal to the concentration of H plus concentration of A minus over concentration of HA. Assuming a weak acid, we can say that the concentration of our HA is going to be 0 0.05 molar. And, of course, the concentration of H plus and the concentration of A minus are going to be the same. So our equation condenses to that. Rearranging we can have concentration of hydrogen ions is equal to Ka concentration of HA square root of that or you can put it to the power half so that's going to be equal to 0 0.158 times 0 0.05 to the power half which for me gives me a value of 0 0.0888 pH negative log of the concentration of hydrogen ions 1.052 decimal places